vont, ils vont trouver ça bon. Bon. The conference uh, tomorrow, uh, the aim is uh, to gather the international community uh, around the, the table uh, with the, the Haitian government uh, to discuss uh, what everyone feels is the major issue of the day, which is security, uh, and uh, identify what the uh, Haitian priorities are and how the international community can respond to those priorities uh, in a coordinated manner. Security tomorrow. It's a very complex issue. We're not going to solve it with one meeting. Uh, but the idea for the meeting is to uh, uh, make it clear to Haitians that the uh, international community is standing with them at their hour of need. Uh, but we want to work with Haitians. We don't want to uh, impose some magic uh, solution from, uh, from outside of Haiti on security. On the political situation, um, I'm a foreign diplomat in this country. It's not my role to propose a solution to uh, the political, the current political situation. I speak with everybody, uh, every faction, every accord. I speak with uh, civil society as well. Uh, and my message to them, I listen more than I speak. And my message to them is uh, we hope to see uh, a very broad Haitian consensus, which includes the political class, civil society, and uh, the private sector uh, towards, uh, towards elections. Uh, and with no specific date in mind, that's a decision for Haitians to make, not foreigners. Um, I think what we want to see first is a, a political accord. There's a few accords out there and uh, some are emerging, some are still uh, discussing. Um, we'd like to see uh, an accord of the accords or a fusion of all the accords. I, I think the political solution needs to be inclusive. Everybody needs to be a part of it, uh, civil society and political actors, including the current government, but not limited to the current government. And then once they get together and put something on the table, um, as a good friend and partner, we'll react to it. The humanitarian question is even more complex. The reconstruction of the South is a very long-term project. Canada is absolutely concerned with the security situation. Uh, and Canada believes, I think, as pretty much everyone out there, uh, that uh, security must be uh, re-established before we can have elections. Now the definition of re-established we can argue in a political science seminar, uh, but certainly in the current context it would be very difficult to have elections, in particular with competing political accords for, for the transition period. When the political class and civil society and, and the private sector don't, don't uh, don't find common ground, um, it's the Haitian people who suffer. 4.6 million Haitians live in a state, according to the UN, of humanitarian emergency. What I am competent to do is come here, observe, listen, and see. What and what I'm seeing is a population in the capital in particular, but also outside, that's being held hostage uh, by these criminal gangs uh, and by the insecurity. Uh, and that's what we need to work on. C'est bon. <rire> ouais. Fait que là, je vais